Several days ago, new reports came in that the DPRK has tested another missile by launching it into the Sea of Japan, also known as the East Sea, on Wednesday morning, and is one of several tests that the country has carried out just recently. Now, this missile test, the timing of it is certainly significant. This comes right as Donald Trump is about to meet with the Chinese President Xi Jinping. And one of the main topics they're going to be discussing at that meeting is the attempt to try to get the DPRK to surrender its right, its necessary means of self-defense. Now, the U.S. has had a very long-standing position against the DPRK having nuclear weapons because it would allow them to defend themselves from U.S. imperialism. So the, the, the recent statement that Donald Trump made was that he was going to do it with or without China. And the DPRK responded by doing a missile test. Now, this is certainly an indication that they're not concerned about Donald Trump's words. Nothing has changed. We are not going to back down. We have a right to self-defense, and we're going to carry it out. Now, China, however, is stuck in a little bit in the middle. Uh, their preferred situation is the DPRK remaining where it is, but with a great deal more of geopolitical stability. The DPRK and China have a mutually beneficial relationship, and a global political stability would only help that relationship and would benefit both of them. So what China really wants here is just for this whole problem to just go away so they can go back to doing trade the way that they've always been. But the U.S. feels that it needs to compel China to do something about the DPRK's you know, moral right to defend itself from U.S. imperialism. But the the main point here is that the DPRK chose a very specific time in which to carry out this test, right when Donald Trump says, oh, that's it, we're going to have to do something with or without the help of China. The DPRK is, is saying with this act that they are not going to back down and that they are going to continue to promote their lawful right to self-defense against U.S. imperialism. Thank you for watching. If you like this program, then please head over to my Patreon page and set up a monthly donation. It's your donations that keep this program running. Also, if you would like, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share in various social media.